Hello guys, um, welcome to Aja Infotech. Uh, we are going to uh, show you uh, how to increase a mailbox size uh, in Outlook 2016. Um, actually, um, it's a, a simple task, but um, for this, uh, we are uh, facing so many difficulties in Outlook uh, sending and receiving email. This is not a um, very um, difficult job. At first, uh, we have to uh, open our Windows um, uh, registry editor. Uh, for this, uh, we have to uh, select our um, Windows button plus R. Actually, we have to um, open a run uh, button, then we have to put it uh, R E Z E D I T. Resit it. Um, actually, uh, it means registry editor. Then we have it will go to a um, uh, registry editor. Now, as we are uh, going to put uh, some uh, value uh, for uh, mailbox size, uh, we have to go to um, his key current user. There are several kind of uh, key. His key classes root, his key current user, his key local machine, his key uh, users, his key current configuration. Uh, for this, uh, we have to uh, in, we have to look into his uh, key current user. Uh, we have uh, to go uh, to uh, software. <clears throat> Actually, Microsoft Office is a software, so we have to go to software. Uh, software, then we have to enlarge Microsoft and Microsoft, and then Microsoft uh, it is Office problem. Uh, as uh, this computer, Windows 10, we are uh, using uh, Windows Office 16, then we have to enlarge Office, then Outlook. In Outlook, uh, in, you will see a PST folder. If this PST folder uh, is not here, then uh, you can create it. Uh, you can see uh, I am deleting Yes, I am deleting it. Then uh, you can easily uh, in, um, uh, new, newly uh, create a, a PST file. It's a new, that key. Uh, sorry, uh, it's not a uh, it's a different um, okay mm, it's a new key okay. um, it's not in profile um, in delete and we have to in outlook it should be a PST file yes uh, PST uh, so a PST folder is created then you have to click it you have to click you can see there is no value um, is assigned in these boxes PST outlook um, now uh, we have to create two different um, value uh, for our um, file size it will be maximum large file size or um, one maximum large file size uh, how much how much size a file can be um, existed in outlook uh, so uh, as uh, here we are using uh, windows uh, 10 and office 2016 uh, our um, uh, mailbox size maximum size is 50 GB you can use 50 GB for this 50 GB uh, you have to put over 50 GB uh, that's mean um, I can uh, actually first uh, into a keyword file because uh, it is a 64 bit office <clears throat> if you are using 32 bit office then you have to create dot below uh, and but as uh, i use i am using here uh, 64 bit office so uh, i am creating a keyword below uh, new value of then uh, the uh, this um, file name is given to um, m a x l r e maximum large file size a file is created it's a keyword file then another file will be created it also keyword file as it is 64 bit of fish it will be one large one large file 
size. So if we double click maximum large file size, it will pop up a new window. Uh, we have to select decimal. Then we have to put a value here, which is more than 50 GB and it can be put at megabyte. So uh, for uh, 50 GB, um, it is uh, 51,200 as uh, we have to put it over 50 GB. Um, um, you can uh, see, uh, see we can uh, put here 70 GB, uh, 70, 70 cross 1024 it's 71680 71680 megabyte it's a decimal put base then click ok a value is created 71680 then we have to put one last one double click then we have to put a one last file set it would be uh, moreover 90 percent or 95 percent of uh, maximum last file sets we have we had uh, put uh, 70 GB, then 70 GB, uh, 71,680 is, and 90% is, 90% is 64,512. 64,512. We will be uh, check a decimal uh, point base and then click OK. So, uh, two value is created. So, um, we have uh, already done our maximum file size uh, where uh, there is a problem I see a problem here maybe a maximum large file size is double created it's a decimal oh yes uh, here in decimal we have to put 64,512 in decimal food. then click OK I hope you can understand um, uh, we have already um, done our uh, full job and then you can easily use your outlook and you can see your mail will be gone and you will easily uh, open your outlook in 2016. Thank you guys uh, for watching my video. If this video will help you some more, please uh, subscribe my channel. Thank you. Thank you so much.